Hello everybody, what's up? Again, we have math and we are going to review some on pages 507 and 508. Well, two dimensionals are not really hard. They are really easy, we just need to understand it. So let's understand it by these practices. Open your book and keep it in front of yourself. Well, it says how many line segments the shape has. This triangle, how many line segments can you see? That's right, it is three. It is three line segments. And let's circle all the words that describe the shape. What this shape describes? Is it ray? Is it point? Of course it has point, but the line which it has point on one side and it continues on the other side, we say it's ray. That's right. And number three, this shape. Is it an open shape or closed shape? Can you see that the side is open? Of course not. So that's closed shape. Number four. This shape, as you can see, it has three sides and it's not meet each other at the same point. It's an open shape. How about this? Is it line or line segments? We said that a line which it has endpoints, it's line segments perfect let's go for the next one here we just have to write whether the shape is open or closed this shape it has three side but one side is empty it's vacant so it is an open shape what about this this shape which is curved and it's something like oval it's closed shape how about this pentagon of course it is closed shape how about this one this shape is it closed or open it is starts from here continues and finishes here Oops, so it's not linking to the start point. It is open shape. Next question. Write how many line segments the shape has. Let's count how many line segments this shape has. One, two, three, four. So number 10 has four line segments how about this one you tell me first how many line segments can you see so how many eight that's right about this shape how many line segments can you see Yes, it's the same as a square, four line segments. And this shape like oval, how many line segments can you see? One, two, three, four, five, and yeah, if your answer is the same as me, it's six. Let's keep in continue about the others. This half circle, we have to write it's open or closed. Can you see this is open as a, as a place or closed? Well, of course, it is closed. How about number 15? It's like G, but vice versa. It starts here, goes, and finishes here. And it's not meeting the start point. So that's open shape how about this one 
number 16 it has it just starts here and finishes at the start point so it's closed shape and the last one number 17 it's triangle is there any start point is there any open place no so it's closed shape Question 18. What's the error? Brittany says there are two endpoints in the shape shown at the right. Is she correct? Brittany says there are two endpoints. Is she correct? No. The shape is ray. There is one endpoint and the ray continues in the other direction. Number 19. Explain how you can make the shape at the right a closed shape. Change the shape so it is a closed shape. How we can make it as closed shape, guys? Well, if we draw six line segments, so the shape starts and ends at the same point if we just it starts here it goes here and ends here but if we draw a line here draw a line here it will be a closed shape so draw a sixth line segments right now currently it has one two three four five line segments number 20 look at Kali's drawing at the right what did she draw how is it like a line how is this different change the drawing so that it is a line as you can see it is a ray in the shape and a ray is like a line because they are both straight while a line continues in both direction as you remember line continues at both direction this flash is also here but here we have point end point while a line continues in both direction a ray continues in only one direction mm -hmm. again ray is like a line because they are both straight while a line continues in both directions a ray continues in only one direction as you see it has end point and continues in this direction but line continues also from this part question 22 Draw a closed shape in the workspace by connecting five line segments at their endpoint. I drew this pentagon. You can draw anything which it has five endpoints, five line segments. One, two, three, four, and five. You can draw anything, guys. Now let's draw each shape where it belongs in the table. These four shapes, the one which is closed shape must be here and the one which is open shape must be here. Well, let's start with the closed shape. Which one is closed shape? Diamond, this L shape, this triangle shape or this half circle? Well. The first one is diamond, the next one is this half circle, the next one is this, and the last open shape is the L shape. That's it. It's finished. Have a good time.